first time in eight years, Atlanta will have a new mayor. And we're just about a week away now from voters casting their ballots. Tonight, most of the mayoral candidates participated in a unique forum held at Dad's Garage. Yes, Fox 5's Claire Sims is live at the venue. And Claire, this was anything but a traditional campaign season event. Yeah, this event was designed to really engage the people in the audience with everything from pom-poms to kazoos. Undecided voters tell me that it really helped them narrow down who they'd like to support next week. A mayoral forum unlike any other Monday night inside Dad's Garage. The event, put on by the Center for Civic Innovation, not only tested these mayoral hopefuls' knowledge of Atlanta city government, but required them to think on their feet. One question, what single issue would each candidate actively stand up for? Education, 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 intersection of all of our issues in this city. No anti-LGBTQ plus state laws. We are going to be a sanctuary city, not just in terms of immigrants, but in terms of the wonderful diversity that we have here. We're going to embrace diversity, we're going to respect diversity, and we're going to celebrate diversity under my leadership. For some questions, candidates could explain their responses. For others, they could only write a few words on a whiteboard. The topics range from how to improve community and engagement in government to how the next mayor should deal with claims of sexual harassment or assault within the city. The room filled with mostly undecided voters. Many say the pointed questions help them make up their minds about which candidate from the crowded field to choose. You know on the screen they don't really seem like people, they just seem kind of like figures, but when you see them in person, uh, just getting to see them being actual people and, they, and also interacting with each other, um, it really kind of showed me who was a leader. The responses were a lot less cookie cutter than I had seen in other forums. So I appreciate it and I feel like it would have gone a, a long way to help people make up their mind.